Nearly every day across the country, crews install pedestrian and highway bridges using ABC, accelerated bridge construction techniques. Rather than closing down a road to build a bridge, the bridge is prefabricated off-site, sometimes right next to the road. It's considered just as safe as a traditional bridge, but there is risk. When the assembly is slid across the road and raised into position, putting the bridge under stress and strain. There's so many variables that could have gone wrong in this construction, from the materials themselves, from their strength. The concrete takes a number of days to come up to strength. While ABC bridges can cost 30% more, they are faster to build, reducing road delays and safety risks. Since the late 80s, hundreds of bridges have been built this way, including the Willis Avenue Bridge over the Harlem River in New York, the Ben Sawyer Swing Bridge in South Carolina, and the Twin Span Bridge over Lake Pontchartrain in Louisiana. And this bridge on the George Washington Parkway in Virginia. In most cases, engineers use the same steel and concrete they use in traditional bridges. Veteran bridge engineer Ralph Arastro. So a typical bridge by conventional methods, let's say, might take a year. Using ABC, you could reduce it to six months or perhaps three months. And in some cases, whole bridges are constructed over a weekend. In Miami, investigators will look at the design, construction, and quality of materials to determine a cause. In a tragic irony, Florida International University has long been a leader in ABC engineering research. Tom Costello, NBC News, McLean, Virginia.